thank each and every one of you. I want to thank CNA for being here, for being for, here for all of us, for everyone. I want the whole world to know that we have a broken healthcare system. I'm, I'm a mother that's gone through so much, and a lot of moms are going through the same thing that I've gone through. And we need to stop this, and we need to stop this now. If our government can have an emergency meeting to bail out $700 billion, they can always have a meeting, a 10-minute meeting for health care. This is so important for all of us. I wish I could go there and then face them eye to eye and tell them, only if you would do it, only if it's your own child. Because they don't care. They're getting paid every month. They're getting paid on time. They're cutting our health care so the CEO will enjoy his life or her life. This is not right, you guys. We're going to fight. I will be here for you guys. I'm going to be here for a long time. I'm going to fight. I will not give up for all of us, for my daughter, Natalie. She's being with me. She's being with me. She was with me last night. She came in my dream as a baby, and I know she's telling me, go, Mom, go get them, and I'm going to do it. Thank you so much. Insurance company can't decide who's going to live and who's going to die. Only doctors and nurses. Thank you. Thank you, and thank you, CNA. I'll back up a little to go over my history. I've been a nurse for 30 years, and two years ago I had worked on a Friday, and the following Monday I went into the emergency room and was diagnosed with cancer. That started a two-year series where I learned that I have had not just two, but actually within the last year a third cancer. I've had chemotherapy, I've had four major surgeries, and radiation is still a possibility. But what happened that was so horrible is that after paying into healthcare my whole professional life, I found out that as the owner of a short-term policy, that once the policy expired, not a single insurance company in this country would insure me. It's a road to becoming uninsurable if you become ill while you're on a short-term policy. And this is corrupt. 